Hollywood Live with Tanya Hart. Trey Young is the latest NBA star to say I do. The Atlanta Hawks guard married his longtime girlfriend, Shelby Miller, in the Bahamas right after Philadelphia 76ers center Joel Embiid got hitched as well. Well, footage of Young and the bride enjoying their first dance as husband and wife with Forever Young emblazoned on the dance floor. By the way, they were at the Ocean Club on Paradise Island, one of my favorite spots. It sits right off the shore from NASA. Well, they were circulating all the stuff on social media over the weekend. The couple both dressed in white shared a lot of intimate moments in front of some of their celebrity guests. Young also shared highlights of his big day on Instagram when he and his spouse walked on the beach together. They had fireworks in honor of their union. Really a special weekend. By the way, they share a one-year-old son, Titus, together and are expecting a baby girl very, very soon. So congratulations to the couple. The Rodman name might just be about to have a whole new dimension added to its reputation. Yes, I'm talking about Dennis Rodman, of course, one of America's biggest ever stars, a five-time NBA champion. And yeah, he was a little weird, but you know what? He was also one of the best defensive players in basketball history. But now the world is going to be introduced to his daughter, Trinity. Potentially, she is the ace in the pack of a USA team that is taking a shot at history at the Women's World Cup in Australia and New Zealand. A tournament victory here would make the U.S. the first team in men or or women's soccer to win three straight World Cups. Trinity says that they are the most ruthless team ever. She said, we will never give up and we're going to get the title. Well, Rodman says that her team is really something special. So she is expecting a gold medal as well. I love the fact that the 21-year-old Rodman is supremely confident in herself and her team. But you know, her story is really one of hard knocks. She had to overcome a lot. And sadly, she has a difficult relationship with her father, Dennis. But in terms of sports, clearly the apple did not fall far from the tree. And I'm so proud of her. Congratulations to Trinity and the team. India Irie's recent comments questioning the abundance of twerking going on at the recent Essence Festival by performance Megan Thee Stallion and Janelle Monae. Well, it's going viral. Apparently, Megan invited about 20 attendees to join her on stage for a twerk session. Well, you know, after all of this and the video went out and it was captioned, Hot Girl Boot Camp, and India Irie suggested that Monet's actions were counterintuitive to the festival's female empowerment message. She says, quote, The issue is, what is context? Humanity does everything, but does everything belong on stage? Well, India Irie blasted in a post a whole bunch of stuff about not everything is for kids, not everything is for everyone. So when we as a culture make something like this mainstream, it shows lack of discretion and discernment. I got to tell you, Irie is not the only one thinking like this. She's getting a lot of support online. And somebody even came out and said, why y'all twerking on a stage where that dirty mop has been and a whole bunch of other stuff, including people's feet? A very good question there. And for all these stories and a whole lot more, don't forget to follow me on social media at Tanya Hollywood and at AURN online.